at the hospital that we take you here? Yeah, so I think familiar with hospitals. Um, it moves quite fast, mm -hmm. so it's very different from the U.S. So coming in, I think it's a little, I feel quite confident and comfortable with you. Um, it's definitely a little um, out of sorts when you don't know exactly what's happening. So I think it's helpful to have someone otherwise, if I would have been here by myself trying to understand who was doing what, that would be um, a little harder. But otherwise, yeah, I think it was quick. It was painless. What type of tasks did you get here? You yeah, feel so, comfortable about anesthesia and everything. Yeah, yeah so I mean, um, pretty much pre-op, uh, blood work. So I'm assuming they're just gonna run an entire panel. Um, checking my lungs, maybe because, you know, I have asthma. Um, lung CT, I think, is common. The EKG is expected. Um, I probably would have thought they would have done blood pressure and weight, but They're gonna, maybe they just do that yeah. the day of the surgery. So yeah, I think it was things that I would have expected with, with what okay. surgery I'm having. Yeah, thank you. Yes. <laughs>
I will give it some thought, but I feel really good. I feel like the entire company and the team um, has everything in hand and that everyone in my experience has been incredibly nice, respectful, very thorough in their explanation and providing translation services, which for me, non-speaking, non-Turkish speaking and only speaking English is uh, super critical. So yeah, really, really appreciative, really thankful and that's about what I have. problem about them and your medical history is okay also okay. I will make a check for your body make your markings and you will be ready for the operation okay let's make the markings and go This morning went very smoothly, so uh, that's really nice. I'm not yet excited, I'm not scared, I'm just kind of, I, I think I can't believe it's here, so yeah, but I feel good about the doctor, so. Yeah, my journey's been good. I mean, I was lucky enough to be able to spend several weeks here in Istanbul, getting to know the country and the people, so um, I really like that, and I think that, um, that's helped me to feel really good about the decision to have the surgery here versus having it in the United States. I'm very satisfied with the care, so um, I think everybody's very friendly and attentive. No one has made me feel uncomfortable. It's obviously nice to have a translator, um, but everybody's been very professional and uh, yeah, so I feel really good about the staff and, and definitely about the doctor. I'll see you after the surgery. <laughs> Every day we will check on you, even you are at the hotel also, change your dressings, remove your drinks, do your massages and show you how you will do your self massages by yourself in the long term, okay, all the aftercare, you need to just eat healthy, drink plenty of water, at least 3 liters of water is needed, especially for the first few weeks, okay, because your body will need it. And if you eat and drink, you will feel yourself much more strong in very early time. Every day you will feel much better. And if you need anything, we will be always in touch with you, with your patient coordinator. You can text her anytime you want, okay, for any kind of your, your needs. But by the way, we will check on you in the hotel, in Kune, and we will do your afternoon the best way possible, okay? Do you have any more questions? No. Okay. Thank you, sir. I feel good. It's a, this is a very different experience than I've ever had with other surgeries that I've had, but um, I really like the staff. Um, I felt confident in the doctor, so I had no worries about that. And I'm liking the after picture so far, so yeah, I feel like it. Leading up to the surgery was really great. It was a great morning, um, and then after the surgery, the night was a little rough, but um, that's to maybe be expected. But I'm excited to see the results later on.
um, it was great. It, um, I think I had a very different expectation about how things would be based on the only exposure that I've had to this type of surgery by someone close to me in the United States. And I feel like this um, whole process, the way that it's structured by Dr. Erson and his staff and um, the way that it's managed, I feel like it is a it is at least incredibly different from what I saw in the United States and I think it's um, much more peaceful and um, much more informed and feels very supported, especially since I am in Istanbul and Turkey for the first time ever and I'm here by myself. So I think one wouldn't be this comfortable unless it was um, the entire process was a comfortable process. I would say the experience starts before you get here, obviously. So having a dedicated patient coordinator. I was Melissa and she's the bomb. Um, but every single staff member that I have come into contact with has um, been just as kind and just as professional and just as poised. So I think one, starting with a dedicated person that can answer your questions and act as a go-between for you and the doctor, and then meeting Dr. Erson via video first time, I was completely confident. Um, he just has a very kind, composed manner, and I don't think it's a put on. He has been consistent in every single interaction I have had with him, and his staff speaks very highly of him. His staff, um, I work in the healthcare field, his staff is 10 out of 10. And I think you can only have that because they work for someone who treats them with much value and then they have much value for each other and for the patients. So um, I would highly recommend, if at all possible, if you're considering um, coming to Istanbul and working with Clinic Wise, I would recommend the package if, if it's Possible. I think having assistants who are tied to the doctor um, have the same values uh, that their company has. Just them coming to meet you in the small things, right? So when you check out from when you're discharged from the hospital, like when you're getting picked up from the airport, or when you have to go kind of maybe from one place to your preoperative test, any kind of small thing, I think having, um, even if you had a family or friends member here, I think having um, a member of Dr. Erson's staff is, it just makes you feel, like I said, more supported. It makes you feel um, more protected. And I think it makes, it ensures that they will manage other people and other staff on your behalf. So if if you do need any sort of go-between, you have them and you, like I said also, you can kind of just stay at peace and just worry about what you need to know and what you need to do well to have the best outcome possible. I, unlike maybe some others, I made this decision in a very, very quick period of time. I did not do a lot of research. I did not spend a lot of time on doctors. I felt uh, inside my spirit uh, very strongly with what I read on the internet um, when I first looked into this about clinic wise and obviously uh, by a blessing got the absolute best patient coordinator who um, you know is not here to sell or close the deal she's or he is here to be your partner um, and to make sure that you feel like you're making the best decision and also to support you if you decide that this isn't the decision for you. And that made it possible for me to have one or two conversations and do pictures, do a video, fill out an application, get a quote and feel good to move forward with it. It's very quick. Um, I wanted to have the surgery as soon as possible because I'm traveling a lot and the staff, you know, did everything possible to ensure that that happened and it moved very quickly. And then from the time you arrive here, it's really a very quick process. And I think for any of us, we all have lives and that we need to go back to. So that's a really good thing. Um, 
And like I said, just knowing that you don't have to call a taxi and you don't have to worry about how much, you know, directions from one place to the next or any of those things. I mean, the only thing you want to worry about is l loving this country, which I adore, and being able to see what you can when you're here. And then meeting the wonderful people, whether it's the staff or it's just the local Turkish people, they're awesome. And getting prepared for your surgery and then healing. You don't want to be thinking about anything else. And I think that that is incredible value for the price, which again, I'm representing only myself and only what I understand of the pricing in America. But um, this is value that exceeds the cost so just kind of think about your peace of mind um, when you think about the package that they're offering you they're offering it to you to ensure that you have the most seamless peaceful experience possible not not to get other business um, opportunities for those in Turkey at least I believe Thank you. you're welcome <laughs> just honest yeah.